two pack, three pack, smoke. One, one, one pack, two pack, three pack, smoke. One pack, two pack, three pack, smoke. If it's work that you need, then it's money. Ladies and gentlemen, you're tuned to DJ Digimane 2K. Sorry. No, maybe Squilliam came for revenge or some shit. Dude, it feels like I've been penetrated by fucking Barker. Oh, fuck. Dude, I can see the light. Spidey, can you swing us across with your web? No, I can't swing you across. <laughs> Breaking news! A mysterious madman is on the loose, killing and stabbing everybody he comes across. If you're seeing this broadcast, lock your doors and grab your semi, because this is going to be a bloodbath. This has been Richard Johnson with BDM. Make sure to share and follow us online at BDSM.com. Again, that is BDSM.com. We will continue more on this story right after this brief that brief commercial break. Okay, people, just to let you know, this kind of videos now is going to be slightly different what than the, the other fuck? one. Because... So much again for doing this it was a fucking hoot. I'll probably be live Wait, again tomorrow. Hold up. We got one more submission from Bimjo. Bimjo. Holy shit, how did I miss that, dude? I'm fucking hyped. Let's watch this shit. Hell yeah, man. Pull it up. Bimjo edits present. That was the worst fucking edit I've ever seen in my whole life. Dude, did he edit this in like Everclear or some shit? Honestly, man, I've seen gotcha editors do a better job than this. No, not even gotcha editors. Like, my dad could have done better in fucking Premiere. <sighs> this is just fucking despicable, dude. He's just a lame G, dude. Put him, just like disqualify him, honestly. Fuck that, bro. Honestly, man, that edit was so bad. I think we need to make a how to edit like Bimjo, you know? Bitches really need to know how to edit like him. Facts. I mean, not uh, Bimjo. All right, guys, that was a really good fucking HC. It was nice seeing everyone's edits, except for you, Bimjo. Fuck you, man. That edit was ass. But I guess I end stream now. All right, man, you have a good one, bro. You too, man. Take care. All right, I'll see you, man. Win big!
Hey kids, welcome back to another video. Today I will be showing you how to edit like Bimjo. Without further ado, let's get started, shall we? What the hell was that? Ah, whatever. As with every edit, we're gonna need some music. So Bimjo pretty much edits only one genre, which is swag rap. All you gotta do is load up SoundCloud and go to the hip hop and rap tags and find a low key swag rapper. Bonus points if they're singing in any minor key, preferably G or E minor. The song should also have Auto Tune Pro and Sound Godizer enabled to the max. Where the bitch is at? Once you find a song, just slap it into AE. And for this tutorial, I'll be using swag.mp3. So the next thing you're gonna wanna do is the velocity. Now for Bimjo, Bimjo's Velo, he tends to really show off the animations in his cinnies by having really fast movement in the cinematic, and he does really smooth transitions and flow between the subjects he's focusing on. The cinnies are usually the smooth part of the edits, while his POVs are on the sharper side, unless it's the final shot. Then it kinda goes smooth or, or something. So you're just gonna wanna slap some Twixter on, slap some timer map curves, because this is the hardest part of the edit, so you really wanna study up on your flow. Once you get your Velo down, let's talk about pan crop. You want it to be there, but not notice like there's an earthquake going on, but rather just really subtle, especially on the POVs. Now for cinematics, it's a bit different, but you want the pan crop to flow into each other, but instead of just flowing into each other, you want the camera movement to also correspond with each other, so it's not just all blending it in in post. You also want random slow parts that zoom in a lot with no movement, so we can slap some overlays on it later. After you've done the pan crop, velocity, and song choice, now things are about to get serious. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's time Time for effects. So for effects, Bimjo sort of follows a pretty universal approach in his edits where he'll stick to the same style. You're not gonna catch Bimjo with an orange CC unless it's client work, but then again, who wants to do that shit? For this part, we're gonna need to summon the trinity of effects. Distort, Echo, and Duotone. Once you've got all these effects, all you gotta do now is pretty simple. Slap them on some adjustment layers. You also want to keyframe these for transitions and impacts. Never do it for the sake of just doing it like on POV or random long clips because that's what frame glitches are for. Also, never do frame glitches on impacts unless it's a long animated sequence. For impacts, that's what the trinity is for. Also, throw some rays here and there. Once you've mastered these effects, it's time for the cliche everybody was expecting when they clicked on this video. Overlays. For overlays, you just want to make your own CRT effect by slapping some scan lines, pixel separations, chromatic aberrations, curves, and a bunch of other bullshit that's not relevant. And then you- Wait a minute, you stupid bitch. Can't you just buy his overlays from his store? I mean, he made them himself, and it'll be exactly like him. Listen up, you stupid bitch. All his overlays are almost 50 bucks in total. You really think I'm gonna spend my hard-earned cash on a video that's probably only gonna- Shut up, you fucking emo. You're just jealous that he probably knows how to run an overlay business, and he probably has a bigger co- Alright, that's it. <laughs> Sorry about that guys, where were we? Oh yeah, so you're just gonna wanna make some CRT stuff and slap them on here. Once you've got all your effects done, it's time for the CC. You just want something that's either green, blue, or very desaturated. Anything on the warmer side or resembling a screaming Japanese girl anime edit should be avoided. So for the CC, we're just gonna slap a lot on it. Maybe decrease some colors and of course the usual curves. Now that we're almost done, let's add some motion blur. Finally, we are almost done guys. For SFX, it's extremely extremely easy. Just grab some normal gun sounds and slap OTT on it. And now things are starting to look good. What the hell? Hey Order, meet me in the goons of the 420 tree. We bout to have a hoop. Well shit, I guess I head over there. Dude, this whole thing has been fucked, man. We can't even leave our room. Nick has been stabbed, and all we have left to eat is shitty ramen noodles. You know what I think? I think it's time to get some revenge. Don't worry guys, I got a burner. What the fuck are you doing? I was thirsty. What are we gonna do now? I'm a win big. Let's 
go fuck him up. Thank you.